I bought a bunch of viral cat toys and Ellie and I are gonna test them out. Ooh, this comes with catnip. Oh, you're gonna get lit. I found these all over TikTok and Instagram and just driving to a bunch of pet stores and we're gonna review them to see if, you know, they're high quality, they are built sturdy enough. It's a, you know what a review is, it's a review. I think we're just gonna start with this cat scratching post. If anything, I feel like this would be really good to like crack your back on. Ugh. I have the back of a 75 year old. So let's see if this helps at all. Oh yes. Oh, baptize me. That's the spot. Oh. Whew. That was an experience. If your cat ends up not liking this, I highly recommend it just for chiropractic usage. Okay, use your claws, mama. Use your claws. Scratch. Scratch, yeah. Oh, is it nice? Okay, maybe you need a little more assistance. Scratch. This is going about how I thought it would go. I'm trying to have a cat cooperate with toy reviews. You wanna give it another try? It seems pretty sturdily built. Sturdily? Sturd, sturdy? It, it's built well. She isn't a huge uh, scratcher anyway. Like, she doesn't do it on the cat tower. So I had a feeling this wouldn't, you know, be applicable to her. Um, but say I'm a slightly overweight cat. Let's see how sturdy it really is. Right, here we go. Wow, this holds well. This is impressive. I'm shocked. I give this a solid 7.9 out of 10. Pretty good. All right, on to the next one. This is a fishing toy. I think it's for lazy people who want to just sit on the couch and um, it's already tangled. So how do you... Okay, okay, she seems interested. Okay, let's see how far this baby flies. <laughs> That's it? That's like three feet. I can make her interested in it. Let's try and get it. Woo! Yeah, but okay, if this was like eight, nine feet long, then you could really, you know, optimize the laziness. Cause then you could just sit on a couch and just whip it from across the room and then just reel it in. But for this one, so I gotta give it points cause she is interested in it, but she's also interested in anything that moves. Oh. Okay, ready? And three feet. This is a good 4.6 out of 10. If this was like eight or nine feet long, solid eight out of 10, maybe an 8.1. This one I was curious about, because I think it just folds out into like a circle or something. Definitely gonna love that. Okay, how do we do this? Do I just have to like stretch it? How do, what? How does it connect? What? I think I get the concept of it. You attach it like this. So it's a, oh, hate that sound. It's a great concept. I just don't know how to connect it. She, she doesn't really get it either. Let's say I'm a slightly overweight cat and I want to have an afternoon nap on it. Let's uh, close yourself on up here. Just as I thought. Gonna sit down right on it. You know, something tells me it's not holding up. I'm gonna give this one a 3.6, and if you have a slightly overweight cat, it'll crush it. So, do with that as you will. I feel like you can't go wrong with a tunnel. Like, tunnels are always good. Of course, it's zip tied in a million different places. Love that. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna put put like a toy in there to entice her. Oh, never mind. She gets it. You like the tunnel? You like the tunnel, mama? 
If someone could explain to me the science of why cats just automatically know what to do. What are you doing in there? What are you doing? <laughs> she auto immediately got into this thing and having a blast. This came free with, uh, I think the tunnel. Yeah, get the toy. Yeah. Yeah, get the toy. Now let's say I'm a slightly larger cat. I don't think they could fit through this, but let's test it out. I can get one arm and my head through. If I was a bigger, if, if, if you were a bigger cat, I think you might struggle a little bit with this. Just my opinion. Wait, I'm actually stuck. <laughs> oh. 8.3, the only downside is it's a little bit, it's pretty narrow, so it can't fit a cat over like 13 pounds, and then it's pretty short, but other than that, it's a tunnel. Cats love tunnels. Did you have fun? Do you like new toys? So this concludes the first cat toy. Oh, you have something to say? Yep, you love toys, huh? You just love the toys. I think she liked this toy review, so make sure to like this for her. Um, let me know if I should make more of these. She's kind of freaking out. She wants to get back to the toys. Any specific toys that you think we should review, let me know. She's freaking out. We're gonna go play with more toys now. Ma'am, can I get your thoughts on this useless piece of junk? Okay, any thoughts on this cat scratcher, ma'am? There you have it.